2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 First Look Review, Upgrading the Off-Road King With the latest slew of updates, the Wrangler Rubicon 392 is safer, hardier, and more capable than before. The Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 has been king of the off-road trail since arriving for the 2021 model year, and despite a move to electrification in the form of the capable Wrangler 4XE, diehard adventurers like their off-roaders to look like this, sturdy, aggressive, rugged, and powered by a 470 horsepower V8. The 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 benefits from upgrades to the interior that make it feel a lot more comfortable and modern, but it also gets a bunch of safety enhancements, together with new standard tech. This includes the cool new trails off-road feature that 4x4, loving folks will appreciate. It's quite possible that this is the best Rubicon 392 yet. When is the 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 coming out? Order books are already open in the USA, and the release date for the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 is set for later in 2023. 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 Price and Competition we're not sure what the price is for the 2024 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392, but since there have been substantial updates made, it's likely to cost a few thousand dollars more than what consumers are paying currently. The 2023 Rubicon 392 has a starting MSRP of $82,495 before auctions and excluding destination fees, expecting to pay over $85,000 for the 2024 version isn't a far stretch. There aren't any direct rivals that quite compare, but the Ford Bronco Raptor is worth considering. It's also a competent off-roader and the 2023 model starts at $83,580. With 418 horsepower and 440 pound-foot from its V6 engine, it's down on power compared to the Rubicon 392, but it also boasts iconic looks and impressive off-roading heritage. New Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 Exterior and Colors The most noticeable change to the Wrangler lineup carries through to the off-road Focus 392. This includes a redesigned 7-slot grille that is slightly less in your face but leaves no doubt as to the Jeep's identity. It also makes installing the available worn winch easier in terms of placement, this winch has an 8,000-pound capacity. The new Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 SUV also comes with an integrated stealth antenna that won't get caught up in branches or other foliage while you're traversing the great outdoors. And for 2024, there are 10 new wheel designs across the Wrangler lineup. 2024 Wrangler Rubicon 392 models have LED reflector headlamps and LED fog lamps as standard, with power-heated exterior mirrors and skid plates for the fuel tank and transfer case. Rubicon models come with heavy-duty tubular steel rock rails in black as standard, and the 392 rolls on 17-inch beadlock capable, low-gloss smoked bronze wheels, which are wrapped in 35-inch BF Goodrich all-terrain tires. There are two tow hooks up front and one at the back, and a body-color three-piece hardtop as standard. There are three alternatives for the roof, including the Sunrider for hardtop by Moper options. Unique to the Rubicon 392 are quad tailpipes for the dual-pipe exhaust system. As far as exterior colors for the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 go, the usual palette is available, with Earl, Firecracker Red, Granite Crystal, Silver of High Velocity, Hydro Blue, Sarge, Bright White and Black, as well as a new color called Anvil. Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 Dimensions Dimensions for the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 include a standard wheelbase of 118.4 inches. Overall length is 192.5 inches including the spare tire, which makes the Rubicon 392 the longest model in the range, thanks to the standard inclusion of Extreme 35 package. It's also wider and stands taller, with width and height coming in at 79.3 inches and 75.5 inches, respectively. Naturally, the off-road focus means it has impressive approach and departure angles at 46.7 degrees and 39.8 degrees, while the breakover angle is 24.5 degrees. The Rubicon 392 has 11.1 inches of ground clearance. 
undoubtedly the heaviest in the lineup, the Rubicon 392 has a curb weight figure of 5,268 pounds. Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 engine and performance. The 6.4 liter V8 engine on the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 has been specially tuned for this model, with 470 horsepower and 470 pound foot of torque. Almost 75% of its peak torque is available at just above idle speed which is ideal for crawling over tough obstacles, but it's also enough to ensure a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of 4.5 seconds. The engine is mated to an 8-speed automatic tuned for the high torque system, and Rubicon 392 models get paddle shifters for a little more engagement. The Rubicon 392 models also get a Selectrac full-time transfer case with a 4LO ratio of 2.72 to 1. The V8 engine is a cast iron unit with aluminum heads, an active intake manifold, variable camshaft timing, and twin spark plugs per cylinder. 392 models are fitted with a rear sump oil pan, high mount alternator, and free-flowing exhaust manifolds. It also gets a functional hood scoop for improved cooling, and the Hydro Guide air intake system is comprised of a tri-level ducting system with a one-way drain in the air box to separate water from incoming air. This means the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 can ford water up to 34 inches, even if water washes over the top. The Rubicon 392 gets a new Dana 44 HD full float solid rear axle that allows buyers to upsize tires more easily, and the trailer tow and heavy duty electrical group package is standard, too. This adds a class 2 hitch receiver and heavy duty amp alternator and allows for towing up to 3,500 pounds. Since the Xtreme 35 package is standard, the Rubicon 392 gets unique shocks to withstand off-road laboring, and an electronic front sway bar disconnect allows for additional wheel travel when things get a little rough. Gas mileage Gas mileage for the 2024 Jeep Wrangler range still has to be confirmed, but we can use the 2023 model's EPA figures as a guide. That model achieved 13, 17, 14 miles per gallon on city highway combined cycles, which isn't great, but isn't unexpected either. The automaker states that the new Jeeps have fuel saver technology with cylinder deactivation, which sets the engine to four-cylinder mode to boost efficiency when it's not under load. We may see a slight improvement in fuel economy, but it shouldn't be any worse. With a 21.5-gallon fuel tank, a theoretical range of 300 miles is possible. Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 Interior and Cargo the interior of the Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 392 is nicer than ever before, thanks to a substantial refresh for the new model year. The top-end Rubicon 392 has the same washout interior with drain plugs for those times that you're out in the wild without a roof or doors, but it doesn't skimp on the niceties either. The seats are leather trimmed, and both front perches are heated with 12-way power adjustment. Even the sport steering wheel is heated, dual-zone climate control is standard, and the interior lighting is of the LED variety. You also get remote start and remote keyless entry as standard. There are five seats in the Wrangler Rubicon 392, but space isn't ample, that's not the point of this car, though. Still, the cabin is better equipped than ever, with a 9-speaker Alpine sound system with a subwoofer, numerous power outlets and USB ports, and a load of improved safety features. The latter include standard first and second row side curtain airbags, enhanced seatbelt pretensioners, and improved structural safety. The safety suite for the Rubicon 392 includes forward collision warning, blind spot monitoring, and rear park assist as standard. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.